Well, on YouTube, you don't know it's your girl Tiana. This is part two of my vacation vlog, and we decided to start today off by taking a swim in our private pool. And then we went to breakfast. I had blueberry pancakes with the open face omelet. Joe had an open face omelet too, and he had banana pancakes. This is day three, and now we're going into the town. <laughs> Our first stop into the town was at a liquor factory and this is the where they make the blue carousel and it's all made here. We got to see the ingredients, how it was made. We even got to try different samples and then we got drinks from there. Mine had coffee liquor and Joe's had blue carousel in it. So now we're gonna go get tattoos. It's so spontaneous and I'm so excited. This is me waiting to get tatted and I thought I was so cute because I am but I was really just super scared so I just recorded myself. This is just how it looks before, before I get tatted. Oh my god, I'm so obsessed. I'm gonna tell you what it means in a second. Oh now after being super dramatic, I reveal to you my tattoo. Mm. <laughs> you can't move then i just sat around like a chicken wing and waited for joe's tattoo to be finished i mean and being a supportive girlfriend too after our tattoos we went into the town called williamstead curacao and it's a really good town in curacao it kind of reminded me of a mini europe i actually really liked it we went on the bridge we walked around window shopped look at all the beautiful buildings Overall, the entire town was really pretty, super clean, everyone was nice. By the way, everyone in Curacao speaks at least like three or four or five languages. And I really admired that. I love their culture, I love their way of living. Everyone is just so calm and they seem happy. It was really beautiful. This was our last morning so we started the morning off with mimosas in our room because we decided that for the last day we're just gonna keep drinking 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 by the way this guava juice was so good and then we had breakfast at the chop house i actually really like this breakfast this is probably one of my favorite breakfasts and i keep thinking about this breakfast like even now and it's been like two weeks and i can't stop thinking about it we spent our entire last day at the beach and it was so peaceful i really love this video oh my god and then right before the day ended, we went to the spa. I was so excited. It smells so good in there. We were about to get a massage. And this is just us checking in before going in. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry, Joe made me laugh. But look how excited we are. We got some lemon cucumber water before actually going in. And this is just how inside of the spa looked. I really liked the interior. And this is just them explaining to us about the massage that we're going to be doing. Ah, it was so good. And this is just a cute bathroom inside the spa. There were cute robes, but we didn't even get to wear them. And then for the last night, we had French food. And this was Joe's favorite. And I tried a lot of things there that I never had before. It was very interesting. And I feel like I would have it again. I kind of wish that we went here on the first night so I could eat it multiple times, but whatever. I actually thought I was taking a picture here, but it turned out being a cute video, so here you go. Okay, people, so pay attention because this is serious, all right? Joe fit so much clothes in this vacuum bag. It was insane, so it can go in his teeny tiny suitcase. He had 14 outfits. All 14 outfits fit in this tiny suitcase just because of a vacuum seal bag. It was insane. I wish I had a better video explaining. But yeah, look how tiny the suitcase is. All that in that. Oh my god. And we spotted this with the view and everything on the last day right before we went to the airport. And I'm super sad because I wish we took pictures there. That's it. Like, comment, and subscribe. And I'll be back with more videos.